for you. Two East Tennesseans on their way back to Knoxville after traveling to Israel on a mission trip. Of course, we're talking about our Alan Williams. We checked in with Alan earlier today. The rest of the group is still in Jordan right now. Alan making plans to come back home, but the group is waiting for more flights to take off. Well, we have some better news to report today. Two of our friends, Michelle and John Newmeyer, made it out of Jordan today. We met them at the airport, gave them a hug, gave them a prayer of safety as they make their way back to Knoxville. Meanwhile, the United States is ramping up their support for those that are in the Middle East here and in Israel. First of all, they said that they, the State Department, is now evacuating those of jobs of lesser importance, they say. They're trying to get them out, we understand. We had an email from that. Also, I got an email from Senator Marsha Blackburn about lending her support. And also, Congressman Tim Burchett has said he is ramping up support as well and helping those getting out. So that's our status for today. And we are glad that things are moving along, but things are escalating a little bit as we speak in Israel as we speak. So right behind me in the backdrop of the city, ancient city of Petra in Jordan. I'm Alan Williams for WVLT News. Alan, thank you. Hoping for more good news coming from Alan. Of course, we'll keep you updated when Alan and the rest of his group are able to catch that flight home. Next, they will be heading to Tel Aviv to catch a connecting flight out of Jordan.